Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. This is Professor Sistrunk, and I'm reaching out to the students. Okay, so we're about to start again. The semester is about to go into the second part. And like I said earlier in that first video, this is where you begin to do your work. So this is one of the first portals that I want to introduce you to, which I know, I know, you already understand this portal, so I'm not telling you anything new. Most of you have been in classes with me, and you know exactly what to do. I'm just showing you this to jumpstart and get you on the right path. Some of you will be in my Cyber Ops class. Some of you will be in my Linux 218 class, and some of you will be in my CISCNS 238 Linux class. So whatever I do here, this refers to all of you. I'm going to go ahead and click on Cyber Ops because Cyber Ops is one of those magnificent classes just like Linux. Just so you know, Linux without learning cybersecurity or cybersecurity without learning Linux is detrimental to your health. <laughs> You need both of them. But anyway, let me move forward. So this is going to be short. It's not going to be long. It's just going to give you some information that you need to pay attention to. And what I'm going to do here is just say, basically, make sure you review this video first so you can get the scope on where you need to go. Then you're going to go to the discussion session. And in the discussion session, you're going to see other videos depending on what class you are in and you're going to go through those videos once you complete those videos you will have a quiz in here yes it's called a syllabus course content quiz and you will have that in here and then you have your syllabus in here so make sure you review that syllabus people some people don't like to go through the syllabus and that hurts them when they're going through the class now i'm not going to do a deep dive on this because all of you know i always talk about this information i'm just giving you a synopsis on the different tabs you need to be in because there's a syllabus quiz in here that you will be doing now that syllabus quiz whether it's in cyber ops or it's in any one of these other classes cis 238 or cns 238 or cis 218 that syllabus quiz pretty much tells me what you know about the class now here's the catch-all to the syllabus quiz if you do not do it it won't hurt you in your grades it's a bonus points syllabus quiz in other words if you do it you get bonus points if you don't do it it don't affect you at all but it tells me that you know your course and you know exactly what to do i am not making it man mandatory because we grown folk <laughs> we should know what we're doing <laughs> okay so going back up in here and i'm just using this as an example it can be any one of the classes just make sure that you review this video log make sure that you hit the content tab the discussion tab and if you in Cisco classes you know for the assignments you may want to click in there and your quizzes and exams are in Cisco so you don't have to worry about it and that's gonna be your next video log we're gonna walk you through how to log into Cisco and get going this is just a brief synopsis of what you need to do in here because all of you have been in multiple classes, so you actually know how to navigate in here. And if you do not know how to navigate in here, then make sure you watch all of the video logs. They are important. So remember, you will only have a content syllabus quiz in here just to test what you know about this class if you do it you get bonus points if you don't do it you know what they say that's life 
This is Professor Sistrom logging off. If you notice, I didn't click on a lot of these because I want to see who actually are paying attention to the class and who's watching all the video logs. I am using analytics to see what people are doing in here. So that's why I'm being very vague on clicking on things. Let's see what you do.